Welcome to some more Python programming on the Data Analyst. I am back with a pretty cool Python video that I am excited to cast. This video is all about adding color maps to your plots. This means setting up a graph where the highest value is maybe black, the lowest value is white, and values in between are in descending hues of gray. We start off with a standard import of libra libraries. Matplotlib.cm and matplotlib.colors are the modules of interest here. We then see some sample data being applied for later use. It looks like a range is used to construct some evenly spaced values values within the interval 0 to 50. This is pretty boilerplate stuff, but it will set up the Python player quite nicely for a simple bar chart later. Here the data is combined into a data frame. We get a preview now of what that looks like using dot head. Using the built-in length function len, we see that the data frame is of course populated with 50 values. The programmer is wanting to plot this in the editor itself, so we saw the magic command matplotlib inline being dropped in. We can expect to see a plot next, which in fact is the case. This is going to be a simple bar chart, like we're used to, but with a cool magenta color rather than the default blue. We are, of course, interested in something a little more exciting than that from our player today. We see a color map started now. This requires designating the minimum and maximum values in the data set, as well as indicating which color map to use. As I foreshadowed earlier, the choice is going to be different shades of gray. 50 shades of gray to be exact. The data frame is then plotted using the new color map for the color parameter. Um, they're the grays. Oh, that. but a huge mistake. The programmer went for the plot and was countered by a traceback. To prevent this from happening, the programmer really needed to add dot values in the color map and pyplot expressions. Thankfully, this is a fairly easy recovery, and we see those adjustments being made now. There being the dot values. And the plot is successfully up. As you may have surmised, color maps are not limited to just gray, but come in a variety of color options. Just do a quick online search for matplotlib color, color maps. You're watching Python programming on the Data Analyst.